Hey, what's up, guys? C'est Saint Monji, and this is another burning wheel video. And it's about finishing a burning wheel campaign. And uh, it is. I, I'm on my way. I'm actually on my way now to finish. It's the last session of um, my long lasting burning wheel campaign that I've been playing since I discovered the game. So, you know, the, to make a long story short, when I discovered the game, I started to play right away and I, I, and I kept on playing uh, Burning Wheel since then on a really regular basis with a couple of different people, you know, and we created this world, this big uh, world where, where there is like this huge meta plot and stuff. And, uh, and there was a lot of character and um, and it was like uh, this big epic fantasy where you uh, you know you have all these characters from around the world that kind of get together to uh, uh, eventually you know overcome evil kind of thing. Really classic trope. Nothing nothing super fancy here, but we you know it, it's it's been a long time that it's been going on, and we are reaching the the climax today. Now this is an interesting thing though, is that it's been a long time we are trying to reach that climax and we couldn't. <laughs> like we were we were like I don't know what word to use to describe this, but we were game wise not able to finish. It's not about the fact it's not about the story, you know, it's about the game. We were not able to finish it uh, in in uh, in terms of um, a mechanic. Like it's like it's like, and it's not it's not even about uh, we like Burning Wheel so much that we don't want it to end, or we like this campaign so much that we don't want it to end. It's not even about that. We were we were actually playing the game to finish it, and it was not finishable kind of thing so basically what, what happened I discussed as I discussed this a little bit in my uh, uh, earlier video about burning wheel is that you know it's like a wheel that keeps on turning with all these cycles that are embedded in the in the design the, in the mechanic and uh, and so every time you roll the dice there is consequences so basically the thing is that you go into a conflict you you, you know you roll dices to do stuff you want to do you use your wises to create stuff in the setting <laughs> and so when the dice fall it create these new things all the time it's either a new consequence or a new important item for the story or a new important character with your circles uh, test a new important uh, piece of knowledge that is important for the plot and stuff like that <clears throat> so it's been uh, you know it's been a couple months that we are trying to uh, to end this this campaign but there's always oh we need another session are we now we're gonna need like two more or at least three more sessions and we're gonna need to get that NPC back in to finish this part here where there is this the, the, you know this thing we need to, to clear out before reaching the climax and, and and then with all these characters there's about I don't know 12 characters in this mm, mm, uh, you know mega campaign kind of thing and then and so so there was always something you know and on top of that and and it, this is gonna it's gonna go into my personal analysis of this but on top of that the game is built on belief and uh, the beliefs are the bits so you have threats, you have instinct, and you have beliefs. And those beliefs are written at the beginning of the session. So every session, uh, the player writes beliefs for their characters. So basically... So basically what you do is that you... Uh, uh, you, you write those beliefs, and those beliefs are some are goals, some are uh, ethical beliefs about the way you act and the way you do your 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 worldviews, and you know all kinds of stuff like that. 
But the thing is that those beliefs drive the game forward. So what happened? And this is really, you need to reach the end of a campaign in Burning Wheel to understand that. Or maybe we were not playing right. Please let me know. If, I'm, if we are not playing right, please let me know. But this is something, it's like, we were, you know, you need to write beliefs to push the story forward and have kind of like stuff to, to, to do in the, in the campaign in relation with other players and stuff like that. But when you know the, the last, at least the last uh, three or four sessions of Burning Wheel, in our case, we, we, we knew what the climax would be. We don't know what's gonna happen. We don't know how it's gonna happen, but we knew what, what it's gonna be, kind of thing, what it would be or what it will be. And then we were driving t toward that. So, so an interesting thing happened. It's like a lot of the character needed to have the same beliefs, written a different way, slightly in a different way, but the, the same belief because we are going at that thing we were trying to reach that thing and, and if you write another belief so completely different the game doesn't stop so so you have to you have to uh, address uh, the, 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 the design the game in, in with that in mind when you reach the end so so really weird is like we 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 have belief on our sheets that are, that hasn't changed for the last three or four sessions. So it's almost like because we forced ourselves not to write any new beliefs because when you write new beliefs, there's new things emerging and new things happening, and you don't. And, and if we want to finish this, we need not to add anything. So it's it's really hard. It's really weird. Um, I remember, I think I remember Luke Crane discussing a little bit of this slightly uh, in a podcast somewhere, where he said that most of Burning Wheel campaign just end from you know not they, they don't you know they don't finish. They just stop because you know it's just going forever. So so. You know, so it, it was it was really hard to finish this campaign because it, we didn't know exactly what to do with the characters and the beliefs and everything because we were used to play that way, and the Arta cycle is meant to be driven that way. So it's not it's 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 interesting. It's really interesting thing to consider because what did what did what did you do? I mean, you're supposed to play the game in a certain way where you have important things written on the character sheet for you to accomplish or to drive the game in a certain way but when you're trying to finish a, burn, the, the, a game you need to be careful with that because otherwise it will never end it's like a paradox it's like a, a, a little loop a little weird thing at the end of a campaign so yeah my analysis of that wow this first I, I find it a little weird I find it a little problematic. Uh, maybe I'm not creative enough to write good belief to finish in a way that it's not rewriting the same belief all the time. I don't know if you know what I'm saying, if you get what I'm saying, is that you know when you have beliefs that's been driving the, the character for a long time over, uh, over sessions and then you rewrite it all the time a little bit to make it fit a new perspective on things you end up playing the same thing all the time it's not a problem but it's just about rewriting so it kind of kills the purpose now when you reach the end of a campaign long campaign like that where all the stakes are reaching that climax where all the characters around the table end up having the same belief or at least the same belief written differently so it kind of the the the, the define I don't know how to say that. It's kind of killed the purpose of having contradict contradictory belief and create. So, I feel like the the the, the nature of, of Burning Wheel when you reach the end of a campaign, I feel like it's uh, it's it's hard. It's hard. It's not made to be finished kind of thing. It's made to be rolling. It's made to be going. Uh, and so when you're trying to finish it, it's just uh, it's just weird. So what we did is we wrote. Uh, a belief in a climactic way 
We, we wrote the beliefs in a climactic way and we kept it on the sheet till we end. So it lasted two or three sessions. It's not the end of the world, but for the last two or three sessions, we didn't change them. We kept them there and we received the Arta for it. And it was just going through the motion kind of thing. So yeah, this is my analysis of uh, what it is to finish a Burning Wheel campaign. And, and actually, the old, now coming back to the story, like coming back to the, 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 the meat and potato, <laughs> like we don't want it to end. We, the, the, the effect of finishing Burning Wheel is about that. After a year, it's, it's been a year and uh, four months now. So after a year and four months of intense, you know, just doing, doing it, we don't want it to end. We kind of force ourselves to end it, to take a little break, try other games a little bit. <laughs> but it's just, we're gonna go back to this world and we are, we, we're gonna keep on creating it. So, so it, it creates that effect. We, there's a certain addiction to the, to the cycles kind of thing, at, at least for me and for a couple per, per person I play with. It's like, we want to know, we, we, we want to keep going. So yeah, it's, uh, yeah, that's my analysis of what it is to finish Burning Wheel, uh, for, uh, Burning Wheel campaign. So for everybody who, who, who know what I'm talking about or anybody who are uh, actually playing Burning Wheel for a long time, who has been playing Burning Wheel for a long time enough to understand what I'm talking about here and, and what it is to finish a campaign, how, how did it work for you? What did you guys uh, do to uh, encompass that, 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 that situation? Uh, does it ring a bell? Alright, thank you for watching. Talk to you soon.